According to new research from Washington University in St. Louis red bricks can be converted into energy storage units that can be charged to hold electricity, like a battery. Brick has been used in walls and buildings for thousands of years, but rarely has been found fit for any other use. Now, chemists in arts and sciences have developed a method to make or modify smart bricks that can store energy until required for powering devices. While some architects and designers have recognized the humble brick's ability to absorb and store the sun's heat, this is the first time anyone has tried using bricks as anything more than thermal mass for heating and cooling. The red pigment in bricks, iron oxide, or rust, is essential for triggering the polymerization reaction. The author's calculations suggest that walls made of these energy-storing bricks could store a substantial amount of energy. A common material makes an ideal and inexpensive starting point for chemical synthesis. A study published August 7 in Advanced Functional Materials highlights new methods developed by Darcy and collaborators at Washington University's Institute of Materials Science and Engineering. Assistant Professor of Chemistry Julio Darcy and colleagues, including Washington University graduate student Hong Min Wang, first author of the new study, showed how to convert red bricks into a type of energy storage device called a supercapacitor. Darcy said our method works with regular brick or recycled bricks, and we can make our own bricks as well. As a matter of fact, the work that we have published in Nature Communications stems from bricks that we bought at Home Depot right here in Brentwood in Missouri. In this work, we have developed a coating of the conducting polymer pedot, which is comprised of nanofibers that penetrate the inner porous network of a brick. A polymer coating remains trapped in a brick and serves as an iron sponge that stores and conducts electricity. Darcy said. We envision that this could be a reality when you connect our bricks with solar cells, this could take 50 bricks in close proximity to the load. These 50 bricks would enable powering emergency lighting for 5 hours. Advantageously, a brick wall serving as a supercapacitor can be recharged hundreds of thousands of times within an hour. If you connect a couple of bricks, microelectronics sensors would be easily powered. 